in what might be a suicide mission, uh, Catherine wants me to give you my opinion of what's going on with this difference in her hair. Welcome back to the Midlife Ride. I'm Catherine. Chris is behind the camera today. And I have all but given up on trying to find a natural and temporary solution for my gray hair. Now, if you've missed out on that journey, we will link the videos in the description down below. But a couple of viewers from those videos have recommended that I try purple shampoo. Now, I have no idea what this is going to do, but what I'm looking for is something that is going to make my hair shinier. Maybe the brown stand out a little more. I don't know, but I can tell you this. When I am in video teleconferencing meetings, it looks like I am being recorded in black and white while everybody else is in color. So I need something to make my hair look a little less drab. And this is what I'm going to try first. So I'm gonna show you some of my grays real quick. Of course, you can see them on the top. And I'm really most interested in how this is going to affect my look as my hair is right now. But I'll show you, just in case you're wondering. I, I can't see, but I think most of my grays are over here. Um, and then it gets, you know, darker as I go down, but lots of gray right, right in the top but it's all nicely mingled together, just hoping that we can get a nice, shiny, I don't know, less drab result. So I am going to put this on in the shower, rinse it out, blow dry my hair, and I'll be right back. Well guys, I just got done using the purple shampoo for the very first time. And while you're checking out my hair, I'll tell you a couple things I noticed right off the bat. First of all, Purple shampoo is actually purple. I don't know what I was expecting, maybe a little like mostly white, like regular shampoo with a little purple tint, but it is very bright. Second, I had a little bit of trouble getting a lather at first. I kind of had to do this top part, get more shampoo and do the bottom. Um, I did try adding a little bit of water, did not seem to help. When I rinsed out the shampoo, which was after about two to three minutes of having it in my hair, I noticed my hair felt more moisturized. Whereas when I wash with regular shampoo, I mean, it feels like kind of squeaky clean, right? Um, so it wasn't like greasy or anything in a bad way. It just felt like there was some conditioning in it. I didn't use a conditioner in the shower. I did put a leave-in conditioner on after and before I blow dried my hair. The scary thing I noticed while in the shower, and this may or may not be related to the purple shampoo, but there was a lot of hair loss, hair fall in the shower, like chunks of hair that came out. So let's take a look at my hair. Right off the bat, I feel like I noticed a difference when it was wet, just out of the shower. I feel like I noticed a difference after, but what I think has changed has changed the longer I look at it. At first I thought it was lighter, then I thought maybe it was darker. I definitely think you can't see the brown, like the dark brown as much. So maybe it's more blended, but I will need to take a look at the side by sides, probably just like you will. But we'll take a look just right here. I'll part it a little bit. Again, I have no idea if I'm getting the same areas because I can't see myself. But I do feel like it's, you know, a different color. The, this part here was just, I don't know, very ugly to me, like very gray white. But I think now it's more like white blonde, maybe, if, I'm, if I even have the spot. But anyway, I don't know. Again, that was just the first time. The bottle does recommend using it two to three times a week in place of your regular shampoo. So I'll probably do that unless I keep losing tons of hair, then I will probably stop using it. But I'll update you on that later and hopefully have 
plenty of side-by-sides for you to decide if this is gonna do for you what I'm hoping it's going to do for me. I've been using the purple shampoo now for a month and a half, about three times a week, and I definitely notice a difference. I'm still not quite sure what the difference is, but I think I like it. I'm gonna show you my hair. I'm also gonna show you some evidence that I've collected to help make my case. And I need your help though. Leave us a comment down below and let me know what you think. Do you notice a difference? Do you know what it is? Do you think it's better or worse? Now here's my hair. Of course, you've already seen it the way I have it, which is what I'm mostly concerned with. Hopefully you can see my grays or whites or silvers, whatever you think they are. Oh, and if I didn't already say, I'm gonna have Chris put up some side-by-sides so we can see before and after. Down here, I have collected my hair fall. Now I'm gonna show you this on a white background and a black background just in case one is better than the other. But this is the hair fall I collected while I was using the purple shampoo. Now for me, it looks very white. This over here is from before and I see a yellowish orangish tint to it. Hopefully you can see that on the white background. I mean, I notice it very clearly here. But now I'm gonna transfer this over to a black background and see if you can tell. I mean, I still notice a huge difference. This pile, while I was using the purple shampoo, is, is almost completely white to me. This one, you know, it has pigment to it. I don't know if it's a orange or a, you know, light brown, um, kind of just like a tan. Let's see if I can hold them in my hands. If you can see the difference. I mean, I, I definitely notice a difference. I hope the camera will pick that up, but it is very clear to me that, that the purple shampoo stripped some of the color out of the white or silver or gray strands, whatever you consider. So in what might be a suicide mission, uh, Catherine wants me to give you my opinion of what's going on with this difference in her hair. Uh, to begin with, let me just state for the record, I thought her hair looked great before this. Gray or not, she's beautiful to me. With that being said, I definitely see a difference after her using that purple shampoo. It seems a little more, on her head, it seems a little more blonde and even to me than like before the grays really kind of stood out but were also pretty, but I think there is a difference. So that's my opinion. Hopefully I don't pay for it later. <laughs> <laughs> if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the little bell icon so that you get notified every time we release a new video. And we will see you on the next episode of The Midlife Ride.